Hello YouTube, this is Platinum W, and this time I'm going to be reviewing my Bionicle, my mini Bionicle Shockwave. And when I say mini, he's small, not that big. And when I say mini, I don't just mean mini like, oh, he's a small guy, like I made him small. I also mean like I didn't really do nothing big with him, just like a simple mock, not nothing big and all good that you know, they would get a ward or something, just just a mini shock, dark and the moon shockwave, not nothing big. I'm gonna start off with this head because it's the most, it's one of the weirdest parts on his body. He's a cyclops as you can see and the only problem I have with this head is the eye is too big. Too big, I wish it could be a little bit smaller but I have to work with what I have. He has these, he has the like little ear antenna like things let me, f let me fix one real quick okay so yeah he has one he has the ear antenna thing he has that kind of like helmet like head as you can see that helmet shaped like head his chest is not really that accurate I, like I say he's mini I didn't really do nothing big with it so here he, that's his chest and here's the part I like on him the most. I think is very accurate. His gun. It's big and bulky. Like in the movie, it was big up here, then got smaller as it came down to the nozzle. Here's the nozzle where he shoots it, the stuff where he shoots the fire blast from. Here's just the regular gun. Okay. Here's the end part. The hose. The hose piping part where the hose connects to this hose. Okay, let me move his arm so you can see the hose better. I'll just turn him, but see this? This is the hose running along back there until it connects to his back. He has these like shocker like things, like how he had in the movie on his back. He has two of them and I'm sorry that, that the camera is very shaky and it's kind of blurry you can't really tell I have to record stuff with my webcam now because my our our camera got messed up so yeah um, here is his sword sword whatever on his arm oh yeah and his head, there's the um, bottom, oops, he's falling, there's the bottom part of his face, and he's starting to fall, so let me, I'm standing back up real quick, guys. Okay, he's not really standing up, but his um, gun is removable, so let me remove it for It clips onto his arm with these two holes. It has these black pieces that stick out. When you pop it off, he just has this little arm thing, no hand or nothing. Which I don't know why you want, why would, why you would want to do that because it looks just stupid. He just has an arm with no hand or nothing. So let me pop it, pop it back on. And another add-on feature is you can add the sword onto the onto the gun arm like how the toy is so it could have could have that kind of like Megatronus crab claw look except won't be a crab claw just be a gun with a sword connected onto it it won't have the second little um, sword piece at the top that's shorter so let me reattach it and attach the sword real quick Okay, let me show you guys how I attach it. Here's the sword. Here's this piece. It goes right in there. So let me attach it now. And there, you have him with his sword on his gun. And it's right, it's attached into there. So yeah, 
that's about it for my Bionicle Shockwave. Not nothing much, so yeah, just the mini shockwaves. He's small and he's not nothing big that I put a lot of effort into. It's just like, you know, I just made him like I didn't really like do nothing much with them. Well that's about it. Bye guys.